Hi, I'm Kim McCleary, President and CEO of the Seafoods Association of America. In 1991, I joined the Seafoods Association and this community as the organization's first chief staff executive. When I came to this organization, I could not have envisioned all the ways in which my work would become my life and how the people I would meet would shape and redefine me. I've been honored to partner with thousands of volunteers, nearly 100 board members, 50 staff members, seven chairmen, and founder Mark Iverson to advance our mission. I will always be a vocal champion for this organization and its vision of a world without MECFS. Over the past 22 years, I've been part of some incredible work. The drug development and patient-focused workshop that FDA will host later this week, launching the world's first patient-centered virtual institute for MECFS, the Research Institute Without Walls, and dozens of events live and over the web that gave voice to thousands of people with MECFS. I've come to know some of these amazing people personally, people who face this uncertain, chronic, debilitating condition with a brand of courage and optimism I don't think I could muster or sustain. Family members, parents, spouses, brothers, sisters, sons, daughters, who resolve to battle for their loved ones and all people affected by MECFS. Each and every person I've met through the vital work of this organization has touched my life in ways I'll carry with me lifelong. Along with my family, I'll be relocating in June, and it is time to write a new chapter. The vision is clear. The path is laid out before us. Over the past several months, the leadership team has worked together to develop an incredibly strong strategic plan that is already changing the landscape for MECFS research to accelerate the path for safe and effective treatments. There is an amazing team in place that will execute that plan and make it reality for you. I pledge my continued dedication through the end of my term in June, and then I will proudly serve as an active member of the Association's Scientific Advisory Board so that our work together will not end. My personal connection to this community will endure and leave a lasting impression on my life. I humbly thank you for the years you have entrusted me to steward this fine organization. I look forward to watching progress in the days ahead and to celebrating with you when effective treatments and cures return every person living with MECFS to lives they dream of living again. Thank you.